All right, what's going on? And well, as you can tell from today's video by the title or the thumbnail, whatever got your attention enough to click on this video, we are going to be talking about the Hasbro replacement for the Power Rangers Lightning Collection Walgreens exclusive Dino Thunder White helmet. Um, if you're unaware, been living under a rock, whatever have you, if you've purchased one of these uh, Power Rangers Lightning Collection figures from Walgreens, their website, third party, however you got one, you can contact Hasbro Customer Care uh, via their website. Then you can go on their email or live chat, uh, whichever one works best for you in your time zone. You can tell them, hey, I bought one of these figures. I need the replacement helmet. And they will be more than happy to send you out one for free. Uh, you don't have to send yours back. You don't have to pay for shipping. They just ask for your information and then they send you one. Uh, I know some people have gone through like a major checklist to get this. I did not have to go through so many. All I had to tell them basically was the UPC number on the barcode of the box. Uh, I also had to tell them right here, this number, this E, whatever, they wanted that. And that there was like one more number on the back of the box. Uh, I think other ways you can tell them is like the receipt. Uh, you have it or just send them a straight up picture of the figure. I don't know. There's been so many different ways you can get this. Uh, but yeah, uh, mine took, I pretty much, as soon as I reviewed this figure, if you remember that video, I talked about them replacing the helmets. Nobody was sure at that time of that recording if they were actually going to send out a correct helmet. Uh, but they did. And honestly, during that video, I had already done it. So however long that video was ago is when I requested mine, and it finally came in today. Uh, so we're going to be doing a live unboxing. Uh, yes. So all you have to do is pull this tab. And let's see what's inside. And here we go. This is the replacement. I know uh, some people are getting... Huh. Some people were getting... Uh, what was it? Apology letters. I guess I am not qualified enough to be one of those people But whatever so here we have it We have the Dino Thunder white replacement helmet and if you're wondering yes They have all the lines painted and yes These are crooked. It looks like let me see here. Yep. Sure enough. Uh, I know a lot of people were you know Oh, it's crooked I'm not sure what happened there because like on this one, it's perfectly straight. But for whatever reason, on these replacement helmets, they got these uh, these little red eyes here, crooked. But you know what? That's being super nitpicky. I am more than happy to have this versus this. This is the one I've customized myself. Customized. I painted in myself. Normally, I don't display it with that. This was just an attempt to see what would happen. I normally display it with the Bandai Legacy one which was already uh, painted in minus these eyebrows that I just kind of did myself um, in my opinion honestly I think this helmet fit better anyways it wasn't as fat and it sat a bit higher so it didn't make it look like he had no neck but either way I am happy to have this one so let's go ahead pop this off and there we go there's some weird black stuff that came out of this packaging. I don't know what it is, uh, but I got some on my helmet. But there you go. A replacement helmet free of charge from Hasbro themselves. So, yes, um, looks good, right? Much better than my attempt. So, yeah. And... Uh, Yeah, this is the legacy one. So there you have it, guys. This is the replacement helmet they're sending out. So it's a minor disappointment that this is crooked. Not too bad. Like, if you're angling his head, you're really not going to tell anyways. Like, from that angle right there, it almost looks like nothing's wrong. Uh, but if you're looking at it straight on from, like, downward position, you can definitely tell that they are off-centered from each other. But... You can't nitpick that much, right? Overall, super happy to have this figure with the correct helmet paint now that I don't have to display it with the incorrect figure helmet or my nasty, nasty custom one. But yeah, guys, this is basically just a short video. I will leave uh, instructions on how to get one. If you haven't gotten one yourself, I will leave the codes uh, down here. Uh, that way, you know, just in case for whatever reason you don't have it or if you don't have your box, I'll leave the UPC code there. And yeah, 
if you want you can screenshot this tell them hey i got one i don't really care so until the next time guys later